You know, a lot of people talk about the ego like it's a bad thing, but what you don't understand is it's a necessary thing. There's a reason why we have the ego. Yes, ego being overdrawn over too much, egotistical, it's a, it's a bad thing. However, if people didn't have the ego, nothing would ever happen. I mean, heck, if Mother Teresa didn't have the ego, she wouldn't have tried to be seen doing what she did and nobody would even know who she was if buddha didn't have an ego he wouldn't have uh, sought out to teach anybody anything he wouldn't care what they thought he would have just told himself and kept it to himself so we need the ego a firm believer in that there's nothing useless nothing is made for no reason at all nothing is put into our brains for no reason at all you can use everything and the ego is one of them. I mean, we don't have an ego for no reason. We have an ego because it makes people better people. It makes societies better societies. But like everything, if you do it wrong, it's hurtful. I mean, being, being prepared is great. Being paranoid is not. You see what I'm saying? You know, loving somebody is great. Controlling them is not. Protecting somebody is great, but controlling them is not. There's a limit to everything, and the ego is the same way. You know, you, you've got to use your ego to make you a better person. If it's not making you a better person, not making other people better people, then slow down a little bit. Figure out what's going on. Be self-aware. Know thyself. I mean, it's been said a lot by a lot of famous philosophers and psychologists that you need to know who you are and keep your ego in check. But that doesn't mean get rid of your ego. Just pay attention to it. But a lot of people, they're so ego driven that the ego is just part of who they are. It's all about smiling right and looking right and doing right and whatever other people think. Let me back up. Not doing right as in the right thing to do, but the right thing in other people's eyes. Because you care so much about what other people think that you end up not doing the right thing. That you end up hurting people. Your ego is more of a weapon than, than a tool. I mean, ego is, is more like salt on food. A little bit of salt is necessary. But you put too much salt on it, it's going to be bad and bad for you so quit telling people that that they shouldn't have an ego yeah have your ego but don't be driven by it don't go around trying to tell everybody how horrible they are and how great you are and how horrible their belief system is and how great your belief system is let people have their own journey don't be afraid to teach people about your ways and about your belief system i think that's great don't go around saying my belief system is the right belief system and yours is wrong even if you truly believe it you may be 100 percent correct but you're raping them of their opportunity to grow they're on a journey themselves teach them about why you believe what you believe show them why you believe what you believe but let them come up to their own conclusions because if you come up to the conclusions for them they're not going to grasp it as well they're not going to hold on to it but if they come up with it they'll stick with it they'll grow with it don't let your ego ruin or run your life but use your ego to improve your life stay in peace stay in love hey guys i want to personally thank everyone for liking and sharing my videos uh if you want to continue to see my content all you got to do is press that subscribe button and I'll notify you as soon as a new video comes out. I don't get paid for any of this. So if you want to buy some of my merch, like my shirts, like Jesus is a badass or my don't be a dick shirt, uh, you can easily go to my merch store, which is at SOGTV.org, which I will have it in the description at the, every video. So push that, go buy yourself a shirt. I appreciate it. Have a blessed day and I will see you at the next episode. Thank you.